okay in this session we are going to see the algorithm for line clipping uh let me give you an introduction first on line clipping so this is a research paper done uh, on www.cs.helsinki.fi and the basic idea behind line clipping is there is a certain window with a certain boundary conditions right and if there is any line which lies inside as well as outside of the window the portion only inside the window should be visible so the basic uh, line drawing algorithm that we will be following is chomsky sunder uh, sutherland line drawing algorithm and what it does is it basically divides a window into these nine regions and each region has its own unique identity with zero being the identity of the inside uh one being the identity of top two being the identity of the bottom four being the identity of the right and the eight being the identity of the left and uh, this is the kind of the pseudo code for uh this is the pseudo code for calls in the land uh, line clipping algorithm uh, i have implemented this algorithm again in processing which is a java based environment to start off with uh, the problem that i faced while implementing this algorithm was how, how to implement those binary digits 000 00 and and all so uh, that because we have to apply and and or operations bitwise operations on those uh, binary numbers so the alternate that i found was to simply implement that them as an integral value so starting off with as you can see that i have defined inside left right bottom and top as integral values the first uh, function that implemented find code will actually find the code uh, given a certain coordinates x and y position and the way it works is uh, first we initialize the code that is an integer variable to the, uh, to the inside of the window and then based on the boundary conditions we keep on oring the code so it keeps on increasing the value the boundary conditions i have not taken arbitrarily uh, rather than uh, i have a hard coded direct angle value that will represent the window and these are the boundary conditions according to that particular window so uh, moving on the main line clipping algorithm so for any line we require two coordinates the x and the y of the first point and the uh, x and the y of the second point what we need to do is we need to find the code of each uh, both the points after we have found the code of the, uh, both the points we need to determine where the points uh, actually lie so uh, let me run this sketch once <laughs> so let's assume this line uh, one of the coordinates lie inside the window and the other lies outside the window for the cases can be both are outside both are inside so so according to our algorithm the ideal answer should be uh, the portion of the line lying inside the rectangle should be highlighted in red color as you have seen here to to do that first we need to check if both the lines lie inside the rectangle if they do then the code of both the coordinates will be zero and hence uh we can just break out of this while loop and simply plot the line the second condition is if uh the and of both the coordinates is not zero so let me try to explain this if uh, and of both the coordinates is not zero this means they are sharing some of uh, sharing some uh boundary if they are sharing some boundary they have to be outside the window as you can see the uh, the only places where one can be the answer is uh, here and here 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 in all of these conditions any lying lying any lying uh, will lie outside the given window so in this case we obviously know that the line won't lie inside the window so there's no need of processing it further so we'll simply break out the break out of the loop the only condition left is whether a point is lying inside the window and the other coordinate is lying outside the window 
in such cases what we need to do is we need to first determine which edge the coordinate lying outside is closest to once we have found that that coordinate then we need to find the point of intersection between the line and that edge we can do this using simple mathematical formulas for each of the edge here is the implementation of that uh, after this has been done uh, the is line is a boolean variable and if there is actually a line which occurs in the window it will turn true and if it does turn true we'll simply create a line with uh, rgb value 255.0.0 which is a red and this line will be implemented uh, for further uh, understanding of this algorithm what I've done is I've uh, declared a line num algorithm which will let me create n number of lines simultaneously so that I can give you a better visual representation of all the possible cases in this algorithm uh, rectangle uh, as uh, you have seen in this sketch the rectangle is the supposed window and the values of the length and the breadth of the rectangle are hard coded that is it's a 300 by 200 pixels rectangle i'm using a simple for loop uh, to get uh, n number of lines using random function and for each line i'm drawing the line in a white color pattern and then i'm clipping it using a red color pattern now to see possible all cases let me just use this as you can see now since I've unlocked the frame rate now the random function will occur every one second due to this every one second a new set of random variables will find the possible uh, will create a new line and as you can see that each of the cases that was forced under this particular algorithm is covered and any time a part of the line or the line itself is inside this rectangular box it will be colored red and any time it's outside it will be simply white color so this was the cohen sunderland algorithm for line clipping